Hey guys, my name is Michelle. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for stopping back again. And if you're new to my channel, I'd like to welcome you. Today is going to be a quick tutorial. I receive a nail kit with um, like a little um, lamp and also some nail polishes from Nail Reserve. Um, so I'm going to do a tutorial for you guys. So if you want to see how I achieved the looks that I, um, the look that I did, um, the products that I use. Stay tuned. Remember, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up, share with a friend, subscribe to the channel, turn on your post notification bell so you never miss an upload. Again, thank you to Nail Reserve for sending me over these items, and I'll see you guys at the end of the video. So these are the polishes that I'm going to use that I receive from Nail Reserve. All right, that's two polish and um, one base and one top coat. This is the mini um, lamp to cure the nail polish. And this is the box that the lamp came in. However, because my nails are right now a little kind of short, I'm going to be using some um, nails that I purchased from the beauty supply store. I'm going to be using these to put onto my nails first. Right? To put onto my nails first and then Put the polish over top of those so that's my little setup right here okay so i have my polishes here i have my nails that i'm going to use of my nail glue and i have my lotion here for when I'm ready. All right, let's just put this little box away. So, um, thank you to Nail Reserve for sending me these products to use and do a review for you guys. So these are the bottles, all right? So that's a white one and this color. This color. Um, this color is called, I don't see a name. Yeah, and this is the top coat, right? All right, so my hands are looking a little dry right now because I don't want to put too much oils on it. All right, so what I'm going to do is just put these on first. You know with these you just have to measure them out make sure your nails are nice and clean okay guys so I picked out the nails that I'm going to use so I have two sets here one for the left and one for the right all right so, so let's put on a thumb so you could see like I said my cut my nails down really really low um, some of them were breaking so I'm gonna get the polish or the glue and put it all over my nail I just have a napkin here just in case it gets on the side alrighty and then I'm gonna get the nail and I'm just going to stick it on here Oh. Just hold it down. Okay. So that's that's sticking. 
pretty good. Um, you could see where my nail really stops, but that's fine because we're going to have polish on here. So what I'm going to do now, put on the base coat. This I'm one's the like base coat. It's looking, so I'm and what I'm going to do gonna is put that on top of this nail. On top of the false nail. All right. And that's just to harden the nail a little bit so it could last longer. And then I'm going to turn on my little light here and just stick the finger here underneath. I'm going to do it from the side. All right? Just for a few seconds. So these are done putting on, right? So what I'm going to do now is just apply the base coat on top of them. And then I will show you guys what I'm doing. I'm just putting the base coat on top. And then I'm going to put them under the lamp. No. I'm under my little lamp. See? Cute, right? So it kind of changed the um, color of the glue. I think it's the lamp and everything. The color of the glue changed on this one, but it's fine because I'm going to polish over them. So we're going to do the other hand and then come back. So these are the nails. What you're seeing, that white looking part, that's just the, that's just the glue, the glue underneath, but that's not going to matter because I am going to polish over them so you won't see that so i think it's just i don't know if it's the lamp and the glue that makes it turn that color but that's fine so we have them all done all right so now i'm just going to get the polish ready and then i'm gonna polish them okay guys if i'm being honest um they were a little too long for me, so what I did was I just clipped them off, clip off the end. So they do look a little weird right now, but I will, you know, file them and all that stuff later. Um, so this is the gel polish, right? Um, to be honest, this is not a color that I would necessarily go for, right? I don't think this color looks good on my skin tone. 
so then they send a white one also so what i'm going to do is mix these two colors together so here I'm just showing and get a shade that i, that I can like use for me like a tone that i would wear so, um so now i'm just going to that polish and i'm just here taking the polish brush and i'm just cleaning off the polish on a napkin and then i'm going to use that to dip into the mixture that i just made to polish why are you acting like you don't want to come out all right so i'm gonna put that color there and then i'm going to put the white Okay guys, so that's just one coat. So we're not perfect. So we're going to put another coat here. And it's easy to put the um, polishes on something else, you know, to work with it and you don't have to worry about it um, drying up because of the gel. You know, if you don't have the lamp, it's not going to dry. So I like that. Making sure I get the sides. You wanna make sure that you clean up anything um, that's not neat before you put it under the lamp because once it's hardened, it's going to be hard for you to um, remove it. So I'm just cleaning up the sides. All right. Because once you put it under the light, it's over. Okay. So I think she's looking, she's looking pretty good. All right. So I'm going to put it under the lamp and cure it. Now I'm going to put the top coat. All right, that's how we're looking. So now let's cure that with the lamp. Okay guys, so I'm done polishing this hand. Now I'm just putting the top coat on it
And just like that, we're done. Now I have to let them dry. I have to let them dry and then we're gonna file them, okay? And put on some lotion. Okay guys, so here are my thing my nails. Um they're not a hundred percent perfect as far as me um polishing them. I think it probably would have turned out better if I polished the nails and then put them on. But it's okay. We're not we're not a nail tech, we're just doing our nails, you know. So, you know, I did I clean up the sides and everything with the um the um emery board, you know, just go in and just shape the sides up so they can be a little bit more clean and neat and so that's how we're looking so all you need now is to put on some lotion on these hash these dry fingers because you know they've been through some stuff today you can put some oil if you'd like I'm just using the paper towel to wipe off my nail so they can be shh. They look a little bit more shiny once you take off the oils. Okay. And that's how we're looking, you know. You put on a few rings if you want to make sure your hands look nice. That's how we're looking. So overall, I think this polish was very, very easy to use. It was it was easy to blend once I mixed the two colors together. They were, um, you know, nice and easy to work with. So, you know, I'm loving that. Um, the lamp, although it's tiny, it worked great as far as drying the nails. You know, so I would recommend you trying out these polishes from a nail reserve they have a lot of fun colors but maybe next time they'll send me some more brighter ones that i would like maybe some summer colors so i hope you guys enjoy this style of video and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time so this is my hands my hands are talking to you today see you guys next time Bye-bye.